This is Tanisha and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to go over idioms using the word clean. Clean idioms. What does clean mean? Well, the word clean can have many different meanings, such as it can mean having a place free from dirt and grime, free from disease, free from contamination, free from pollution, something that is pure, or someone can be free from alcoholism and drug addiction. What are you clean from, if anything? And what does clean mean to you? Our first clean idiom is to come clean. What does it mean when a person comes clean? That means to be honest. For example, he came clean after the incident so that the truth could be known. That is to come clean clean. What does it mean to clean up? It, it has several meanings. It can mean to make a lot of money or to make something clean. For example, he cleans up very well financially because of the money he earns from work, or she's going to clean up the house for her sister's birthday party. What does it mean to have clean hands? Clean hands. That means to be guilt free. For example, whatever happens, my hands are clean because I had nothing to do with the situation. That is to have clean hands. What does it mean to have a clean bill of health? That means a person who is in good condition. For example, she passed her physical exam and now has a clean bill of health. That means to be free from illness. What does it mean to have a clean break? That means no sharp edges. It can also mean a sudden separation from something or someone. It's a sudden, complete end. For example, they made a clean break out of town when they left the bad relationship. Suddenly something ended. It was a clean break. What does it mean to be clean as a whistle? That means to be pure, not involved in anything bad or illegal. He was clean as a whistle when his office was searched for illegal items, but nothing was found. He was clean as a whistle. Have you ever been told to finish all your food on your plate? So what does it mean to clean one's plate? That means to finish all of your food. Tony cleaned his plate because the food was really good. Clean up one's act. That means to improve. Tony cleaned up his act after getting into trouble with his family. He cleaned up his act. He improved himself. What does it mean to have a clean conscience? To have a clean conscience means to be free from guilt. He had a clean conscience because he told the truth. We should all have clean conscience. Clean cut, what does it mean to be clean cut? That, per that means that person is well groomed. For example, he is always so clean cut when he comes to work. Clean cut. Clean house, let's clean house. I'm about to clean this house because I have guests coming over. Or the organization came to clean house because the company had illegal stuff going on inside. To clean house. Let's make a clean getaway. That means a smooth escape. She made a clean getaway from the crowd. Run free, clean smooth escape. What does it mean to have a clean slate? That means a fresh start to get another chance. Terry was given a clean slate to start her project over after it was not completed the first time around. Clean slate. Clean sweep. What does it mean to have a clean sweep? That means to win all the competitions or to win the prizes. The team made a clean sweep on the football field and won their fourth game in a row. Clean 
swipe sweep sorry what does it mean to wipe the slate clean it's the same as clean slate it also means fresh chance a fresh start a new beginning what does it mean to be squeaky clean that means it is completely clean the place was so squeaky clean that i was afraid to touch anything because it was super clean keep one nose clean that means to stay out of trouble it's always good to keep your nose clean and to be careful of who you hang around with clean out that means to make completely empty terry cleaned out her closet so that she could give her clothes away to the poor clean out those are a few words uh, for clean, for the word clean to use as idioms. I hope this will help you greatly with learning English as your second language. I can also be followed on Twitter at Queen Esther 100. And I can also be followed on Instagram at 100 Queen Esther. And you can also look at the bottom. The words that you see, make sure you write them down, copy them, make a sentence out of them and practice them. Hope this was helpful for you. I look forward to seeing you again soon and have a great day. Bye.